Hey, baby, how was your... Oh. Hey, what happened now? Well, I went home, she said she wanted to go to a party tonight, and I told her no. I said I wanted to spend time with the family. I don't see that happening now. Mm -hmm. Elizabeth, time for dinner. Elizabeth, would you like to say the blessing? God is great, God is good, let us thank him for our food. Amen. Now, was that so difficult? So, <clears throat> Lizzie, how was your day? Fine. Anything exciting happen? No. Did you learn anything new? No. Elizabeth, can you cut the attitude for one minute and please speak nicely to your mother? I don't know, Dad. Can you get off my back and let me breathe for a second without getting so pissed at me? Stop it! That is enough. Elizabeth, you are not going to the party, and that's it. You don't have to let it ruin the rest of your night. So, uh, whose party is this? It's Kayla's cousin's 18th birthday party. She said we could bring whoever we wanted. Cool. My parents freaked out when I told them, so whatever you do, don't tell your mom, because then she'll tell my mom, and then they'll know I snuck out. Don't worry, I won't. Right. Have... Oh, college boys, too. Oh, it's gonna be hot. friends. I'm so glad you're here. I know he is too. I'm Mrs. Connor, but you can call me Lydia. Where are my manners? Come in. Come in, come in. Have a seat. So, how do y'all know Tommy? Are you seniors too? Do you go to St. Andrews? Uh, we actually go to Central. We're sophomores. Um, we know Tommy through Kayla. Oh, I see. I see. Well, he should be here soon. I don't know what's taking him so long. Oh, Tommy, there you are. Your friends have been waiting. Kayla, can you show me the bathroom? Can you come in and have a seat? Kayla, what the hell? I stuck out of my house for this? Uno? We're gonna play Uno? Look, if we didn't come, no one would be here. You saw him. He's obviously not the coolest guy. He doesn't have many friends. My mom said I should invite y'all so there would be at least some people here, but I knew y'all wouldn't come willingly, so I had to lie a little. Well, yeah, we wouldn't come. This isn't a party. This is a birthday party for like a five-year-old or something. Please, Liz, just stay for a little while. It'll make him and his mom happy. Fine, but you owe me. So Claire, where do you think you're gonna go to college? Who's 
know, it's been a while since I heard any angry stomping or seen an eye roll. You think she's cooled down any? Nope. She can stay angry all night. Maybe you should go talk to her. I would hate for her to go to bed angry. Lizzie! Lizzie! Elizabeth! It's those damn headphones. She keeps those in, she can't hear a thing. Oh my goodness. What? She is not there. What? I went into her room, looked, pulled up in the sheets. She got stuffed with pillows. She has gone to that party. What are we gonna do? She has never done anything like this before. Mike, Mike, what are we gonna do? I'll tell you what we're gonna do. I am gonna get in that car and I'm gonna drag her butt back here. I'll be back. We have to leave. Liz, I already told my parents I was spending the night at Kayla's. Kayla's here, I can't go back home, we're staying. This is worse than spending the night with my parents. I wanna go home. This is not how I picture spending my night either, but we're not leaving, sorry. Hi kids, I think one of your parents is here to pick you up. Elizabeth, it is time to go. Oh, we were just about to cut the cake. Please don't go. Actually, yeah, Dad, I'm getting pretty tired, so I think we should go ahead and go. Actually, no, I think we'll stay. We'd love to have some cake, thank you. Thank you so much for coming. We had such a good time with both of you here. Drop carefully going home. Well, Lydia, thank you so much for your hospitality. I know little Lizzie here had such a great time. Didn't you? Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you again. Thank you. Well, that was a lovely time, wasn't it, Lizzie? I 100% get why you wanted to go to that party. It was so worth you sneaking out, don't you think? Wasn't that great? Leave me alone, Dad, please. Oh, you know what? I think I'm going to turn around and I'm going to go get Lydia's number and I am going to set up a play date for you and Tommy. Wouldn't that be great? Wouldn't that be great? 